commentary. Sorry about that. Coming to the end of the 30 minutes. Good job I checked at the end of that round. We're into round 6. I have it four rounds to one in favour of Guillermo Regan Deuce. But it could be a lot closer. I mean, it will be a lot closer than that. Many close rounds, tight fight. Really now it's for me just landing an extra bit punch, extra more punches, accuracies, outstanding so far. Kind of the fight I expected it to be at the moment. In my opinion, just expect pace to slow down, we can lose to make the air wary. Tries to go in with the right hand. Does Regan does? Not bit landing yet. As we've entered, finished first minute of round six, two minutes to go. This round. The right hand misses from Rigo. Now back to Banton about looking for openings. Saw it. Caught with right hand. Not really much on it though. But still, we've got landing shot and in a fight where there's so little of that. Is it just a, a tactical fight? Those can really help you towards winning a fight like this. this. Winning rounds. Oh, good left hand by Rio. That one was landed sharp. Just been exchanged before that. Now right hand from Rigo. So those big shots of Rigo's landing is winning him a few of these rounds for me. He could be about to nick this one again. Minute to go. Still a lot can change, so close. That was a good left hand, really was a solid one. Denair showing you how good his chin is. Denair coming close again with that right hand. Again, a left right, misses. It's only inches away, but still it's inches. The default, the really a good dodge in there, good weaving, bobbing and weaving from Rigo. He fights when he wants to fight. They'll trade when he wants to trade. Good right hand. Straight down the pipe from Rigo. And they're not doing much this round. Duck slow again to Rigo. Really well done. It's making it so hard and glands a right left hand. Then they close with his left duck, but with Rigo slipping to the side, slipping to his inside. Landed the telling shot, and that's definitely a Rigo round. Oh, yeah, I've got fifty nine, fifty five at the moment to Regan Dallas. Could be a lot closer, but that was another one of those rounds that Regan Dows we just won it through Denair fainting a lot, like throwing much himself, and definitely not landing any solid shots. And it was a beautiful left hand in there. It was a little exchange. Here it is again. It was actually a good left hand from Denair, but then a massive left hand by Rigo. It's actually a really good left hand from Denair. I hadn't noticed that. Which Rigo took really well, but that left hand just ended the exchange emphatically. And so sort of judges notice a lot of the time, and I'm noticing it. And I didn't really notice Denaire's left until just then on the replay. Still, I thought Rigo just did enough anyway. Good right hand to the body from Denaire. Definitely knows he's got to step it up now. Oh, good left hand by Rigo. Single shot again. Denair definitely quickening up the pace now. Well, at least with his movement, thrown for more punches. Good shots, good left hand by Denair. Definitely forcing the fight more now. He's into the second half. Probably knows he's behind. Oh, my scorecard may be harsh on Denair. I think he's got to be behind. Probably by two rounds. 
you slow down again though now. It's still that early flourish from Denaire. It was a good start for him for this round. Good movement though by Rigo now. Just getting back on his bike, ducks the right hand beautifully from Denaire. Fires that left hand, it just grazes Denaire's nose. Doesn't really land though, no. any significance. Good duck. Straight left hand from Denair. Almost landing. There you go again, moving, just moving each way, just confusing Denair. Stepping to the left, stepping to the right, stepping to the left again. Just not giving him a standing target at all. He is now, but knows Denair is not going to throw in him moves. Doesn't see an opening, so moves himself and good left hand to the body. From Rigo. He's coming to his seventh round a lot more. Again, it's really close. A few boos, I don't know why. It's a tactical fight. And for boxing fans, this is just excitement. Because you don't know when. Who could be winning these fight rounds? It's so close, so, so much tension around. Good one two from Rigo. Didn't really land, we're both blocked. But in a fight where so many few throws throw uh, punches are thrown, those are what win your rounds. Good left hand followed by right. By Rigo twin the round, but I'm gonna give that to Denair. Started the round well. Definitely pushed it more that round. It's got sixty eight, sixty five to Rigo. This is a really close fight like one thing I don't want in this fight is a blowout victory for one way or the other. You do have these when they're really close fights and somehow the judges gives pretty much every round to one fighter. We really don't want that in this fight. It's a close fight, I've tried to be honest as I can. I'm gonna re go three rounds ahead. Honestly I'm probably a bit harsh and probably should be about two. Probably five to three is more realistic to Rigo. But I definitely think Rigo's ahead at this stage. I think I mean Denair knows that you could see that in the seventh round when he stepped it up for that first minute. I think that won the round for him really. After that it slowed down more to Rigo's pace. But that good start to the round is what surely should have won him that seventh round. One in three match up it is just like we expected. Not the fireworks that some people may have hoped for, but it's definitely the tense excitement the most boxing, purest boxing fans were looking forward to. Both pouring, pouring out the jab at Mom Rigo. The right hand jab from his southpaw stance quickly moves away when Denair looks to unload. Seems to just be reading Rigo, I mean, reading Denair quite well, does Rigo. Knows when he's coming in with his shots, he's just able to move out of the way. Here you go, just keeps moving away, stays in range, waits to see for an opportunity, goes down, stares with a left hand, which does land. Throws that shot, ducks, gets under re Denair's shot. Maybe a few uppercuts would benefit Denair right now. Uh, quick movements again from Rio. Slick skills again, the crowd boo. Obviously, as a fan, you just get to ignore it. You just have to do what the boxers do, and that's just ignore the fans sometimes. Oh, 
Oh, good dog, good right hand there. Landed by the there. Left hand, right jab, right, sorry, from uh, right hand just missing from the net. Left hand just missing from the net. Left to the body from Rigo. That was quick, sharp, accurate. No return from the net. Tries for a left hook, easily avoided by Rigo. He fires a right jab there. Again, right hook round the side that landed. Just misses with a right jab. More a feel of that one. Now near to the ropes, just doesn't get on the ropes, does he? Just hovers around the ropes, but so much skill to make sure he's just finding the space in the ring. Good left hand that was to the body as well by Rigo. Another good left hand. Then they're coming on at the end, just missing with a left hook. Landed the right hand though, but again, I think Rigo just took that round. Seventy-eight, seventy-four. Regan Dows, I have it. Just gonna have a look on Twitter to see how other people are scoring this. Really, is an interesting fight, an intriguing fight. Enjoyable as well for a purist boxing fan. Again, Rigo just. As you can hear from my country, just landing in my left hand. The movement, the defensive ability he's got is brilliant. Now his left hands are really, really landing. A right hook as well was landing quite a bit in that round again. By Rigo. But Dunet having success of his own. Especially with the right hand, the right jab. Right hand landed by Denaire. He went low with that one. As Rio ducked, clever tactic after that. And seen Cage first. First seconds. Cage just continues. Oh, pouring out the jabs. Quick look on Twitter. See how other people are scoring it. Got 78, 75 Rigo. Which is the exact same as me from Stephen Smith. 62 Rigo from Tommy Allen from Boxing Asylum. Seventy nine seventy three from Scott Christ. A bad love hook. So, the majority of people have do have Rigo ahead. I think that should be the case at the moment. When there's not much happening in this round, so that we're not missing much. Oh, left hand. It's like an uppercut slash straight left, really. Straight left, but on the chin, just under the chin. Rigo. That was a good left hand, though. I think by Denaire, I couldn't see quite. He had it back to me, but I think that landed. Rio gets low again. Just avoiding shots. Just misses with a left hook. As does me with a right hook. Denair misses with a left hook. Good right hook by Rigo. That landed again on the chin. Nice combination there. By Denair. Rio needed landed the left hand back. Jab right jab left hand by Rigo. Both didn't land with much significance, but the landed. Again he moves off. Thirty seconds to go in this ninth round in his twelfth round unification fight. Le right hand left hand, right jab from Rigo. Again with the right jab. Just missing that time. Definitely throwing them all again this round. Dene again on the stalking, but not throwing much. Do 
doing a bit on the inside but not much landing and a good lie hand again by Rigo he's controlling this fight more and more the Cuban I'm just hard trying not to feel too smug about this I did not expect it to be a bit closer we've got 88-83 now to Denaire but I just can't go against what I'm seeing you know maybe it's like <laughs> but, um, maybe it's been a bit harsh for a reading Definitely got a lot going. Yeah, it's good being on Twitter expecting to be on the dinner at the moment though. I hope not, because it would be a bad decision. Because Rigo is definitely ahead at this stage and he just shoved. Rigo down, really come out sprinting this round, knows he's behind. Problem is here, will he get caught? You know, surely he would have started like this if he knew. If he knew he could knock him out by doing this, he obviously knows he's behind. Good right hand there by Denaire. The crowd's getting into this more now. Knowing Denaire's going for this, goes for it again, gets tied up though. Oh, and gets a left hand, that's a knockdown! Denaire with a knockdown, left hook on the break. Rigo ready to go, the left hand landed, that could really even this fight back up. It could be crucial. Dene just turned it up now, hasn't he? Landed with just a right hand then. Moves away again though. Good left hand by Rigo though. Left jab nearly lands by Dene. Now he goes down chopping left hand straight to the back of the head of Rio. I mean landed properly. He was down with motion. And a straight right hand by Denaire. And another. Rio pulled out of the counter punch. Rio just wanna really survive this round, knows he's lost his ten eight unless he can Somehow it's good counter punch to knock the air back down. The air really stalking. Here we go on the back foot though. Seems to regain the caught him with a left right hand there. Duck the left. Got his composure back a bit now. Dodges a right hand by the air. Seems to have shook him a bit, but seems to be coming back into it now. He's lost his round, it's definitely going to be a 10-8 round. And good left hand, no by Denaire. I mean, Rigo. Straight down the pipe again, moving again nicely. Coming to the last 25 seconds of round 10. A big round for Denaire, got the knockdown. He's on the break, caught him with a left hand, knocked balance with Rigo. But it did shake him up a little bit. Coming to the last 10 seconds. The last minute, well, Re done there really stamping his authority this round. Yeah, and that's a 10 8 then for Denaire. And that's a big round in this fight. Having 96 93 to Regan knows. Which means he probably needs another knockdown in my scorecard, but obviously, this is my scorecard. Not anybody else's. Could be a lot closer. But that was much better from Denaire. Now first, sl let's have a look again. Yeah, great shot, run right the button. It wasn't really on the break. Rigo was moving backwards. And obviously Rigo getting angry then, turning it into a bit of a scrap. Oh, that's a beautiful left hand. Rigo could tell Dean like that. 
and had to adjust. As you see now, it's Rigo chance of so much champion is by adjusting to this new Denaire we're seeing in this round. This is the old Denaire, though, really. But we've only started to see it in that last round. So now it's up to Rigo to adjust to that. Denaire will feel confident after that last round. Knows he can get to him. There's two rounds to go. Now have Rigo three rounds ahead. Three points ahead at the moment, 96-93. Big shots again by both fighters, both missing really. Good left jab from Dinner. Lands on the side of the face of Regan Dallas. There you go, just moving backwards again. Obviously, trying to get his. Ruben back again. Then I know he can nick these rounds. Oh, and again another exchange. Rio ended up putting there. Uh, definitely the aggressor now and getting the most of these exchanges now. Which is what most people would have expected, including myself to be honest. Nearly lands with a left hand. Good moving by Rio. But he's definitely controlling this round halfway through the eleventh round. Misses of a left hand does dinner. Rio just wants to find his counter punch. That's a good left hand gun punch and then a right hand jab. Dinner just couldn't find where he was. Got popped with another right there. And that's good movement by Denaire. Just I mean Rigo. It's showing really good movement. Left hand to the body, to the chest area by Rigo. Denaire again stalking 40 seconds left of the 11th round. Both have had the successes this round. Still in the balance. Nice left hand there by Rio. Again, just ducking under the air shots, making it sloppy then. Avoiding another onslaught as we enter the last few seconds here. The length round, just never doing left hand, right hand to the body, sorry, by Rigo. Left hand to the head, just misses and then dives under a shot from the air. Really close round that is. I'm gonna give it Nanito. Still have Rio two points ahead, one of five, one of three. As long as he stays on his feet this round, for me, he wins the fight. Obviously, that's for me. Judges could be very different. But I just think he's done so well, Rio, but that 10 8 round is going to really, may really have hurt him. Rio into the 12th and final round. It's been a brilliant tactical fight. Yeah. Um, both fighters have had massive moments. In that last round, both fighters had the moments. That's where he was really close to score. Denaire came out strong, but some great left hands in the second half of that round. And another left hand by Rigo. Pops him around the nose there. Coming again, he's coming at him. Denaire's moving back a lot. Big left hand thrown by Rigo, he's the one on the front foot, right left. He's taking a fight to Denaire, drags him down, just grabs him around the back of the head and drags him down. He wants to carry on fighting straight away. I don't know if Denaire's damaged his nose, he's holding his nose. It's a great left hand. Shot if he has, 
for opportunity because that's another left hand straight down the pipe onto his nose. Now the left hand to the body, Rigo dominating that first minute of the 12th round. That could be massive for him to win this fight. And he definitely damaged his nose or his right eye. So he's really protecting that, he's just not throwing, he's just single handed to go with that left hand. Oh, and another left hand by Rigo. Straight down the middle. He knows there's something wrong with Dunay, he's taking advantage of it, really is. He's loading up now. Oh, and a good left hand by Rigo. Good left hand now. Right hand from Rigo. Oh, and another big left. Dunay's taking his shots really well. There are only one single shots coming at him, but they're solid shots. Minute to go. Oh, it's been a great tactical fight, but really come alive in the last three rounds. It's an entertainment fight. Something's still wrong with Denaire. He's just covering himself. He throws the right hand now. He's really covering himself. Throws a couple more punches. Trying now to steal the round, which Rigo's dominated. He really took it to him. Left hand galore. Left hand's a really good weapon. Another left hand from Denaire, just short that time. I mean, Rigo. Just short from Rigo. Left hand to the body from Rigo. Jab lands from Rigo. Denaire throws a left hook on near the top of the head, temple area. Lands. Not much power behind it this time. It's 10 seconds to go. Denaire throws a wild left hook into the ropes as the two fighters. Fire at the end of the round, and that's it. A great fight. But I think Rigo with that last round, for me, is the winner. That was a great last that's round from him. We'll see the scorecards, by the way. 115, 112. Left eye really swollen there. Down the bottom. Understandable from the amount of left hands landed oh he's a massive massive left hand caught him on the eye it is on the eye wherever he's damaged the bone so Most people sitting here, most people believe Rigo's definitely won the fight. I think he's definitely won it. Even Iguodala, Andre Iguodala. Getting involved, the basketball player from Denver Nuggets. Fantastic basketball player. But I just I'll go to close fight with one fifteen one thirteen. I thought I was one fifteen one twelve I meant to Rigo. I, I thought, thought maybe been being harsh in the first rounds, but from what I'm seeing of other people, maybe I'm not and maybe I might have been being harsh in the end against Rigo, having him just three rounds ahead. I think Re I think Dana the way the way he's uh, believes he may have lost. Rigo definitely thinks he's won. Rightly so, so I think he has. One fifteen, one twelve, I have it. Just gonna stop this again, so get back on Twitter. Boxing